let's head back out to Lynn Park, where Storm Track meteorologist Ashley Gann is for the beginning of the 2016 Steel City Jazz Festival. Having a lot of fun out there as you're forecasting no rain today. We like yeah. that. Well, yeah, we're, we're trying. I'm trying to do the best. You know, I'm trying to do my weather magic to keep any rain at bay. I think today will shape up to be a pretty nice day. It's a beautiful start this morning, a little on the muggy side. Let me go ahead and show you hour by hour what we can expect for the remainder of your morning and into the early afternoon. Temperatures by 8 a.m. in the mid 70s. We're in the lower 80s by 10 o'clock, and we are on our way to near 90 territory for your afternoon. Now, temperatures, I expect them to hold in the upper 80s even as the gates open. At at about four o'clock this afternoon. Here's what I'm tracking for your Friday. Isolated storms are possible. A weather aware. We're issuing one for tomorrow simply to bring your attention to the fact that there will be some inconvenient weather, but it doesn't mean that the criteria will meet severe weather limits for Saturday or Sunday, but that rain is going to continue as we round out the weekend as well. Temperatures this morning ranging anywhere between the mid 60s and Gadsden to the lower 70s in the Birmingham metro area down to Alabaster 68 in T town this morning. With 69 in Jasper and oh, what a beautiful sight to see across Birmingham. A live look at the skies right now where we are seeing some of those serious clouds drifting by and temperatures are kicking off at 71 degrees. Winds are calm at this hour, but looking at our storm track radar because I am going to track that rain for you today. It's clear right now, but I am monitoring a low pressure system back to our west. This low is going to move to the east and as it does, it's going to scoop up the Gulf moisture and really kind of dumps it out over central Alabama over the next 48 hours. Looking at your future cast, I anticipate a few scattered showers through the afternoon today, but these will be very few and far between. This is not going to be a washout rain event today, so you may have to dodge a raindrop or two, but more organized rain for our Saturday, and I think that really it comes late morning through the early afternoon, but this will come in waves of rain and pretty short lived at times. So again, I don't think tomorrow is going to be a complete mess. Nothing to keep you away from the Steel City Jazz Festival for sure today or tomorrow. I do want to point out that you can bring umbrellas and ponchos to the festival, but when the performers are playing, they just ask that you pull those umbrellas down. So I would encourage bring a poncho just in case and maybe grab the rain boots just in case too because Saturday it does look like coverage will be a little bit better. Rainfall is going to increase for your Sunday and with all of the outdoor activities going on this weekend we are issuing those weather awares for both Saturday and Sunday but good news the rain washes away some of that heat and the sun shines back for the early part of next week. Live from Lynn Park on this Friday morning I'm Storm Track meteorologist Ashley Gann and now we'll see how the roadways are shaping up.